Today we'll be painting this space whale on a record. Vinyl records provide a really good surface to paint on and it's a nice way to repurpose something that you might not use anymore. Of course, if you still play them, then don't paint your records because they will sound pretty bad. We'll also be using some acrylic paint pens and these are fantastic as they also have a fine tip on one end, which makes them very versatile. So let's get into it. For this project, we'll be using those dual tip acrylic paint pens, some white textured gesso, some phthalo blue and titanium white acrylic color paint. To apply our paint, we'll be using an abstract expression brush and we'll also be using a tear off paper palette. We'll also need a record. To keep the record in place, you can use small balls of blue tack to fasten it to the table. The first step is to clean any dust off your record. This can be done with a damp cloth. Allow the record to dry, then squeeze out some white textured gesso and cover the record with a thin coat. It's important to use only one coat of gesso as a thin coat provides a more durable primer. Once this is dry, squeeze out some phthalo blue and titanium white onto the palette. Create a light blue and lay this across the bottom of the record. Keep the brush moving quickly and add a little more phthalo blue to the mix as you move up the record. By the time you reach the top of the record, the color should be almost pure phthalo blue. Allow this coat to thoroughly dry. Now we can draw up our whale. We have supplied this A3 reference sheet of the scene that you can find on our website. And it can be transferred two ways, either drawn up direct or the whale can be cut out with a hobby knife. Placed into position and a profile line of the whale can be carefully drawn in with the fine tip of the black acrylic paint pen. Ensure no paint creeps under the paper as it can cause the paper to stick to the undercoat. Carefully remove the paper and then add the details of the whale. The lines on the underside of the whale are called ventral pleats. In retrospect, it would have been better to add these after the white had been laid down. Be careful of the eye position too. I initially put it in the wrong position, but it can be easily fixed by laying blue over it and redrawing the eye in again. Add blue onto the top side and the pectoral fins. The titanium white can then be laid in. Although acrylic paint pens don't blend like paint, if you lay one colour into a wet colour, you can achieve an interesting sort of effect. To create a little interest, I add some green into the blue on the top side of the whale and fins. While you're here, take a look around the Create section on our website and uncover a whole heap of free stuff, from free projects, handy tips and tricks, and techniques to keep you busy. To create satin in the background, we can use the fine point of the titanium white and a small cup as a template and draw three quarters of it in, leaving a small gap for the ring. The ring can then be laid in, leaving the gap beneath the line. The highlight can then be put in. The final step is to add some stars into the background using the fine tip of the white pen.
and voila. Well, thanks for watching. We hope you're inspired to grab some acrylic paint pens and create your own record art. Otherwise, have fun, keep creating, and we'll see you in the next one.